Trickmania World Tour 24 Spring. As I said, we have five maps that were released. And I would say we're gonna do a little bit of hunting now, ladies and gentlemen. And we're gonna start on map one. I don't know if we're gonna go for world records. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. We're definitely gonna go for some clean runs. And we're just gonna see what we can, what we can do on the maps, right? Yeah, I also spent my entire morning today reading through, for example, the spammy Discord. And in general, reading about what people think about the entire announcement and, su and stuff. Actually, people kind of share mostly my opinion. And my opinion is like, not like full negative, but also not that positive. Also, some other things were discovered in the rulebook earlier today, which were completely stupid. Um, maybe some of you have followed it on my Discord. In the current state of the rulebook, for example, it is not allowed that uh, orcs, like let's say with Big, we always have like different car skins for each sponsor, right? For example, here, this is one of our Pizza Hut skins. According to the current rulebook, it is not allowed to use car skins like that in the official competitions. And also some other um, regulations uh, regarding sponsorships were, yeah, very uh, terrible. <laughs> But uh, it was already said that um, it's gonna be fixed. And the reason why um, they were in, in there like that, because apparently they just one by one copied that exact part of the rulebook from the rulebook of Rainbow Six Siege. <laughs> Which is absolutely amazing. This turn you can send a lot. Main issue of this map is this outside turn. Like this one is like, now I got it perfect, but it's so hard to get it good. And then you completely over jump here, as you can see. Like, it's very XD to drive. Probably can go for like a low jump like this. Oh, that was actually a good line. Look how much I gained to my PB. I can gain definitely half a second to my PB in the ending already. So that is uh, pretty interesting. So, hmm. I don't know why, but this slide is super weird. It's good, but it's super weird. Jump into the slide works really nicely, to be honest. I kind of like it. Okay, let's see if I can survive to finish this time. Oh, that was actually good. That is maybe a 106. Ah, close though. Point 14. All right, all right, all right. Not bad, not bad. Got a good run, guys. Point 0.8 by Josh is pretty fast. Let's compare. Maybe I'm also missing something on the map. I have no idea. I don't know what the lines are. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely not the line. I mean, okay, the slides are quite obvious. Just fully max them, basically. Okay, Josh run actually looks really cooked already. And yeah, then here, speed slide abuse, of course. He's definitely gaining in that section. I lost it all until here already, I feel like. <laughs> oh, he's not even going outside. Yeah, okay, he, he lost so much time with that. What the fuck? Ah, but then he gained a lot with this line. Small slide there, but I still think the outside dirt is definitely the faster line. Oh, he goes outside here! Okay. Let's try to push a little bit more. I'm not sure if I'm gonna go for this world record, but... Uh We can definitely go a little bit uh, further than that. Definitely not too easy to get this first slide like really perfect. Very fuck upable. Yeah, minus seven speed into a full speed part. Into complete understeer of the speed slide into minus seven speed. Into better SP. Oh, I'm catching up. Holy shit. Full speed got Granadier. <laughs> yeah, ain't going outside of the line. What is this other line? Like, he just goes like this and then just like... I mean, you do have a lot more speed into this here. Ay, 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 ay. It's kind of hard. It's funny how the most popular thing about this entire um, announcement is literally just the fucking word homo logo bobo gated and like literally everybody is laughing about it Like why the hell did Nadeo use this? I heard that there's like if this word also exists in French like very similar at least and that it's like Somewhat common there But still it's really weird. Why is that word being used? 
What? <laughs> what in the penalty was this? Literally had to Google it. I think like literally everybody had to Google it. I heard from some people that it's also used like in IRL racing or whatever when it's about rules there, but no one fucking uses the word. Mashallah, what a start. Yeah, what is this line, man? I have good speed, though. Plus eight. Sadly, I cannot do a shit with that speed. But more speed. I'm not too convinced by this pre-drift. Neither am I convinced by this outside line. I, mean, I do have a little bit more speed, but... I don't know, guys. I don't know. <laughs> ah, your mama. Fuck. Close door. Ah, finally, all of the cup of the day uh, full speed maps paid off. Finally, I can gain. Finally, I went through all of this pain to gain point one on this map. Absolutely pain, zack zack. Nine. Yeah, that's why the outside turn is dumb. Like, it's so easy to crash. I can go so much more inside there. Like this was so good, you know. But hmm. also, I'm undersliding this one all the time. That I'm mostly oversliding this one by a little bit, I think. Hard to tell for me though. <laughs> I need full speed coach Kanchika. <laughs> ah, not enough. Point eighty nine, though. Okay, PV. Okay, guys, world record potential here. I'm going outside. I don't know why. Yeah, bad idea. No world record potential anymore. It's really satisfying when you get this ending like perfectly, but it's super hard. Did I lose in the end with this wobbling? Yeah, okay, I just. Oh, this outside, like these kind of outside dirt turns, like, and outside dirt turns, it's just all about the entry. And because I wasn't fully outside at the entry, I got too far outside at the exit, as you can see. And then I just touch, like, ah, it's always so annoying. But timing this entry correctly is like, holy moly. Oh, sick turn. Gotta do a small drift. Focus guys, focus. World record maybe. What is that line? I lost point one. I have good exit speed. Where I don't need it. Way too terrible of a line. I have no control. I'm going outside. I didn't touch. I'm gonna drive world record. Suck. By four thousands. <laughs> Jeepers. Alright, there we go. Took one hour 15. I mean, okay, l a little less than one hour, I guess. Most chaotic run ever. I didn't understand shit, to be honest. But, uh, it worked. <laughs> map 1 done. Time to go to map 2. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the ice map. My name is Nadeo, and if you do maps in the Homo Logo Boko gated tournaments, they have to be mixed, but ourselves, we put a fucking ice map into the map. <sighs> Alright, map 2. <clears throat> Definitely a lot of uh, keyboard action will be uh, going on here. In my opinion, this is not, this is literally not a Homo Galactico map. It's just not. Yeah, okay, you have a drift, a little bit of grass here in the start. Yeah, congrats. Okay, for this first ice slide, I can definitely use my, uh, my Wooting Uvu quite nicely. And for this one, I guess I can as well, if I switch like this. And I will have a way easier time with the brake taps. Thanks to Rapid Trigger Technology. Hello, guys. Then here I could go like this and then go keyboard. 
Yeah. I mean, this is definitely a good ice map, but it's just not really... It has too much ice for a mixed map. You can tell me what you want. But it's also like the case with the other maps, to be honest. Like, the wood map also has too much wood for a mixed map. And, but that one I'm just not complaining because I like wood. <laughs> so, maybe a bit, uh, a bit XCD. My PP was honestly not bad. Like, I will definitely not get world record here, I can tell you that much. This is not a Granati map. I mean, the fact that it's supposed to be a mixed map and the ice andes are in the top five shows that this is not a mixed map. Because on a proper ice map, uh, on a proper mixed map, you wouldn't see those players in the top five. Nothing against the players, of course, but you know what I mean. I just cannot not dislike ice when it's on a mixed map like this. It's just impossible to, to like it for me. I have a good run. I do one millisecond of a release too long. I slide out and tie run in mud. Cool. Yeah, hello guys. Oh, I survived! Zack, point two. Damn, insane. It's quite literally punishing because every single time I make like one small miss movement, it just feels like I'm getting like actually completely punished for everything that I did wrong in life. Okay, wait, that is a good start. We bleiben ruhig, guys. I guess by now the entire ice community hates me. <laughs> Just because I always dislike ice so much. Boy, the ice is the gaming. Whoa! Okay, 91. That was pretty good. I mean, when you when you drive ice good, it feels very satisfying. I gotta admit that. But when you drive it not good, it's the complete opposite. Castle is coming up now. Ach du Kacke. This one felt really weird to me yesterday in Discovery. Yeah, I did this like every single time in Discovery. I don't know why. I always fell off here. <laughs> I did it like at least like 10 times. This is very bumpy. Ach ja, I forgot there was an ice turn. Och nee. I mean, uh, yeah, cool. Ice cap GG. I mean, for this, this is an ice slide that I accept, which on a mixed map. But I would say, I would say this is definitely a mixed map. But if the map has three ice slides and an ice 360, then uh, yeah, it's a bit too much for a mixed map. That's not, not, not just saying because I dislike ice. <laughs> but ice is just so punishing and insane in terms of time gains that you can ha not really have like much more than one ice slide on a mixed map unless you want the ice to be by far the most important part. Then. Yeah, but that's just the thing about mixed maps. When, uh, when mixed maps use ice, the ice is very often the most important section. You know what was a good example? That one XP map, if you guys remember. There was that one, only one of the XP maps had an ice slide, and that map was so difficult that the ice slide was like feeling very natural in, the, in it. But when you have a mixed map, which is super simple, and then you have an ice slide, then yeah, it's just, the map is just kind of doomed in terms of balance and stuff. Oh my god, what in the bibbly bumbly boobly boop was that? I bumped so hard, I almost lost my homologation. What the fuck is a 58.1? That's kinda fast, no? Yeah, that's a good speed that I want here. But I'm not really going for this high line that's so little bit... Uh A terrible outside. Wasn't was barely outside line. Could have been more inside, but other than that, kind of good. Okay, fifty-eight point eight. Boah, Soli did point zero. He improved. Soli, what are you cooking, eh? Definitely better outside line now. Didn't gave me that much to be honest. How was that not? How was that not PB? Gonna snap. Oh, and 
that's why I hate ice. That is why I hate ice. I do one break tap too much and my entire run is in the mud. Ah, oh, no, this was a point three A. I mean, I am somewhat consistent. I'm getting quite far into this mud always. Not fast, <laughs> not on like insane pace, but I am alive. Quite often. Ah, the bad bump. And Kibido. Okay, it's third. It is third. Hello, guys, it's Ice Ski. And I gained point two. Like, kind of crazy uh, what journey you made, Vixa. From the guy that gets, like, kind of not really shitted on, but, like, blamed for playing his own track of the day. <laughs> to. Yeah, to uh, being one of the best mappers in the game. <laughs> Alright, yeah, second on castle. Um, I'm not gonna try to beat Oliver Guns now. I'm happy with my second place. <laughs> Let's see how long I need to uh, get a good time here or to get world record maybe. Depends on what we're going for. I don't know yet. But in theory, uh, this map has good potential of being, yeah, very good for me because uh, I am a wood enthusiast. Wood is, to be honest, my favorite service in the game. I just really like the, the high sensitivity kind of things. Could be my most favorite map of the map pack. If it will be or not, uh, will show later. Kinda depends on how good the map feels when you actually push it. Because from the discovery, it's not always uh, easy to judge if the map is good or not. Okay, first of all, of course, I need to uh, remember where to even go here. Okay, this was wood section here. Then it was a tight right slide, but I always have to release for some reason, that's great. Then keep speed here, very important. In general, in wood, you always wanna keep exit speed. I think here I completely fucked up in my PB, if I remember correctly. I had like zero speed. Then here you go down instantly. Oh, you get a gear down there, cheapers. Okay, I see the lines. I understand. I understand. So there is apparently quite some possibility here to gain time, which is good. That's how it's supposed to be. If the map is getting maxed after uh, after one hour, then something is wrong with the map for the most prestigious Trackmania tournament. I think here you intentionally want to go a bit like this and bounce with the penalty uh, in the inside and with that you skip some of it. If that makes sense. I I'm driving the slide like no optimal way but because of the right turn afterwards you really have to drive the slide worse than you usually would. Okay, this slide here is probably full inside abuse. And until here nothing is happening really. The parts where you can really gain time start like here. Here you need to go like instantly down and full inside, I'm very sure. Now we start the slide here, and now I need to pay attention to not go all the way to the outside. More like this, like this was already on the edge. You see I have like difficulties of getting around. Barely worked, luckily. And I have to release again because I'm stupid. And then here, exit speed matters and you also want to go like super inside. Inside and much speed is what matters for wood. And yeah, here, here, this is the most important part, getting exit speed into this wood section. Because you will carry it all the way into the finish, basically. Alright, first BB, 100.59, pretty much one second behind the world record. That's honestly quite a lot, where do we lose one second? I honestly cannot tell. <laughs> also very interesting, guys, um, today on the Spammy Discord, there was a little bit of a discussion about the topic of identities. The fact that uh, the new World Tour maps will not have identities anymore. At least the first map pack. I don't know if Nadeo is thinking about changing that or something. Because of the discussion, I also decided to do a poll asking about what people think about. If they like Trackmania World Tour slash TMGL maps with or without identities more. And uh, a larger amount actually likes identities. I think like almost 70%. Okay, what is the, what is with this outside line? How much? Oh, that was so good, no. How much faster is this? And yeah, result actually was that people uh, want identities mostly. But it also heavily depends, of course. Heavily depends, of course, on 
yeah, what the identities are. Of course, nobody, like, basically nobody is a fan of maps that are, like, super simple, and then at the ending you have a giga-difficult identity, which can just, like, change the entire round, and which is just, like, maybe even random and stuff like that. Nobody wants these kind of identities. But it seems like people uh, like the general aspect of identities. Which is also something I always said. Like, I've always been a fan of identities. But I also, there were many identities where I said, this is giga dog shit, the map is completely ruined because of it. And that's what people think as well. And especially what was mentioned, for example, also by Massa, I think, and also some others. That people um, liked the kind of identities that were like, where you had like uh, an identity at the ending. And then you also had um, smaller versions of this identity throughout the map. So that you basically have like a topic for the map. Like, you know, the like we for example had that on uh, some older maps like Control, for example. I always have to release there. Is it possible to keep the gear in this drift? No, where am I jumping? I completely overjumped. No, where was my gear? Bro, I was like on world record almost. This could have literally been world WR. Almost. My star was not that good though. Yeah, this part I had really good in my video. Ah, yeah, okay. I need to go like giga close to the sign to get like to get close to the things. Zack! World record! Yeah, easy. <laughs> okay, ping. By 8,000. Yeah, okay, that was unexpected. Unexpectedly uh, quick. I got it. Improve? Yeah. Timer's pause? Yeah, let's just continue it. <laughs> yeah, look at the speed. Ah, uh, uh, you can go so much smoother there. But it's ah really mad, Nadeo. But I think I'm just gonna keep it like this. Like I could improve now, but yeah, I don't know. Let's just go next. All right, the final map, Lift Off, guys. The the mini RPG map. This one is very interesting. So let's see what Chef Granadi can cook here. Hardest map of the map pack overall, at least from like the first look, like from this cover, it felt like it. So let's see if I remember everything. I remember this. Then you have the slide. That was kind of smooth. Yo, then you have the giga difficult jump, which. Almo which always only barely works. <laughs> and here I need to start sliding way earlier. Okay, and then this part, which is a bit weird. And if you touch water, you are in the mud. I <laughs> mean, it's so blind, I don't see it though. <laughs> Plus 8 speed, I like that. I look plus 8 speed, gain 08 in this one sector. Everybody likes that. Okay, could be the first PB of the day on this map if I don't troll here. That was definitely not very good. <laughs> Can I even make this jump? I have like no speed. Okay. All right, a point 19. Okay, not bad. So where do we gain? Ah, yeah, yeah. Will you, Masa, Afi, and Mime still share practice maps, or do you think it's every man for himself now? I mean, I will definitely share with Masa. Like, we're gonna practice together. We're still teammates after all. Even if Nadeo's like. Yeah, 2v2, we don't need that. But other than that, don't think we will share maps. I mean, it's also not like very efficient on these kind of maps. Like, there's not really anything on any map either way. <laughs> Honestly, the most exciting map to play is actually map 1 in the map pack, the full speed map. I feel like there you can gain the most amount of times. Like, driving it really fast, it's the most difficult map. It's not this one, I would say. Because you can get like the, the crazy uh, the crazy um, wood sections there. You have the dirt outside lines there. Like here you have a couple of jumps, yeah, congrats. But the rest is like super easy if you compare it to Trickmania World Tour, like, like last year. I mean, these maps are also only not for like an entire season. They're only for like two months of playing, roughly. We will get another 15 of those maps. Yeah. What did the outside?
Suicide Line was this. <laughs> okay. Your boy is cooking, guys. I'm cooking. Ah, not optimal. Hey, I'm getting better at the map, guys. 75. Or oh, so close with like being a Swizzy mime here. Cheapers. So where am I losing against? Um, Brendan. Okay, lost some speed with that. Is this inside line better? I have more speed. I think my line is better. Okay, he got, he got like Giga inside there. Interesting line. Yeah, okay, here this I fucked up a little bit. He went from further left. I don't know if that's faster though. Hello guys, it's 99% steering all the time. Kanadi is the name. Not full steering is the game. Thank you, Nadeo, for still not fixing this. So I mainly lost it in one part. Uh, what is this story again? I already was ahead of Bren there. Uh, yeah, hello guys. Nyko is the name, Insane Stored is the game. Now where am I going, man? I'm a blame witch. Yeah. 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 Yeah! Zack! Peng! 46! World record! Out of fucking nowhere! <laughs> okay, that, that was unexpected to be honest. But my stop was just insane. I think with that, um, we can call it a day with the first hunting session of the Trickmania World Tour. I really hope you enjoyed, guys. And I just got beaten on 01. Yeah, hello guys, my name is Stuft. Fuck. I'm gonna snap.